Hello everybody, welcome to Sheetal Rao Art Studio. This is Sheetal Rao. I hope you guys are really doing well. In this video, I'm back with the new idioms and phrases that you can add in your regular speech to bring diversification in your communication. So these are kind of more advanced and uh, I really find myself uh, awkward when repeating the same words, the repeating the same sentences over and over again. So I always try to learn new idioms and phrases. Like um, let's take this example when uh, you are you are really looking forward to meet someone, then you can invite that person saying, "Hey, let's catch up soon," or "Hey, let's hang out tonight," but or or simply let's see each other tonight, or let's meet each other. But these are really basic idioms and phrases. These are really basic phrases. So you can add more advanced idioms and phrases to sound like a more native speaker. Do you wonder what native speakers or, or Americans would say while inviting somebody to just for just meeting purpose? They say, let's grab a coffee tonight. Let's grab a coffee tonight. Or let's grab a coffee sometime. So this coffee doesn't necessarily mean that you guys are gonna have coffee and you're gonna sip coffee. No, it really means um, to just meet each other and talk. Or you guys can go to a park, to a movie theater, wherever. It doesn't necessarily mean to have coffee. You, so this is a way to invite somebody to meet. Let's go have a coffee tonight, okay? So to, for just the confirmation, you can ask if that's okay with you. Let's go have a coffee tonight, if that's okay with you. So this is for the confirmation. Now to respond to this, uh, you don't want to say, you don't want to sound rude. You want to sound polite, okay? American, American English is uh, all about being polite and not uh, not sound rude to anybody or you don't want to offend somebody with your words you don't want to hurt anybody okay so you can't actually say no way I don't like you I don't want to spend time with you just go to hell <laughs> no we can't use such offensive words so if you want to reject if you want to refuse if you want to deny you can simply say Oh, that's so kind of you, but I have some other plans. So that's a really polite way to refuse. Or you can say, oh, that's really tempting, but unfortunately, I have got to do a lot of work. So this is also a nice one. Or you can say, if, if you don't, if you don't want to refuse straight away, but you want some time to think, then you can say, uh, can I just take a rain check on it? Can I just take a rain check on it? It means you really need some time to make a decision. Okay. Or you can say, um, um, Oh wow, this is really cool, but I don't think I can make it. So you are not saying no, you don't sound rude here. You sound really polite. So these are really nice ways to refuse somebody, to refuse to somebody for any invitation. So these are really nice idioms and phrases you can add to your communication. And it will also enhance your communication skills. Don't you think so? Okay, so if you really find this video helpful, don't forget to smash the like button and also subscribe my channel for more such videos and also press the bell icon. Thank you so much for watching this video. Stay safe, stay healthy.